once you get your up and running in Pentacle Cart, you're going to want to immediately um, put together a Google base feed. And if you don't know what that is, then go over to google.com forward slash base. And in a nutshell, here's what Google base is. It's, a, it's basically the Google products search engine. So when you've got all your products into Google base, you can click here to learn more about it. Let's go take a peek at it real quick. So Google is a place where you can easily submit all types of online and offline content, which will make searchable in Google. Uh, and they do it with we do by submitting a feed, a data feed, that gets put into the Google product search. And what that means is when someone does a search inside Google for buy a basketball, the search results are going to give you the top three paid results here. Then you're going to get some organic rankings of number one and number two. And then Google's going to give you shopping results for buy a basketball. So this is where your product will show up. So the beauty of this is using a Google base feed is that if you've got obviously relevant products to an individual search, Google's going to present the image and a link to not your store, but it's going to give a link to the product description that you're uploading. And it's going to give the, you know, the brand number, all this information here, the description. People can actually buy it then through Google Checkout, but they can also um, see where it's where it's uh, available. So, for instance, here locally in the Twin Cities, you can see here's all the local listings where I can go buy a basketball. So, the importance of a Google base feed is to um, the most important thing is to get your products found uh, on the internet. And it's a huge leg up. It's a huge advantage compared to organic rankings and paid listings. Because if you look here, you got one, two, three, four, five listings. These are all the paid ads, which people kind of gloss over nowadays. And they're scrolling down to look at these, these listings here. Uh, and then right in front of their dead center of the page is going to be an image of your product with a link to more information on it. So this, this area gets a lot of traffic. Obviously, someone is shopping for a basketball. So... Google's going to give them some nice shopping results for buy a basketball. Uh, in addition to that, you don't have to do any search engine optimization to get this ranking. All you have to do is have your products in Google Base. So it's a no-brainer, and it's an extremely smart thing to do. So absolutely, you want to be setting up your Google, Google Base feed. You can only go out 30 days, so make sure the feed expiration date doesn't exceed 30 days. So I usually go do it about 15 days from uh, the day's date. So let's say it's uh, March 10th or we're going to go out to the 25th or we'll go out to the 30th so what this is going to do is google base is going to come back in 15 days and look for the same feed uh, that i had up on in the same feed file and grab it and if anything's changed it'll be changed so and then you want to export the data feed when we do that it's going to say here's your xml file frugal.xml so go ahead and save that file on your desktop and then what you have to do is go back into google base sign into your Gmail account, go back into Google Base account, and follow the instructions on uploading your XML file. You can also upload your XML file to your server uh, into the root, uh, which it would be www.yourdomain.com forward slash frugal.xml, uh, or you can put it in any folder you want, but it's going to want to look for the, it's going to want to look for it in the root. So if you, if you have a FTP access, go ahead and dump it up in there. If you don't, then call Pinnacle, Pinnacle Cart, and uh, they can help you get it in that file in that file set up correctly for you. So, but you're going to have to extract the ex export your data feed here and get that XML feed. Set up your own Google Base account, and then absolutely start putting this in. Put your uh, put your uh, feed into Google Base, and you'll see your sales go up. Frankly, because again, people pay thousands of dollars for first and second page ranking, uh, first and second place ranking on Google. And here you are with some content in the search engines uh, in the Google base, and you're going to be placed right up here as well. So uh, that's one of the first things you should do after setting up your store.